Oh, it's working. Yes. No. What was that in the background? Sorry. I saw that for a second. What the hell was that in the background? Hello everybody, Gray still plays, and we're back with more Downfall. You know what there's no time for, and what these two girls have no time for. It's BS. Let's get the hell out of here. Somewhere around here is the axe-wielding psychopath. Uh, and we've got to find where that door was, and I don't really remember. I Careful feel like now. it's... I think the man that follows me went through here earlier. I feel like it's around here somewhere. Oh, yeah. I think we're getting close. Oh, shit. I hate it when you go one way, and then you pop out in a different direction. Alright. Wall. Was this wall here before? Yeah, that's a good question. I think that that was the pumpkins before. Oh man, this whole place is different. Son of a bee. Alright. Alright, it's still the same. You never know. Alright, um... Well, I guess we'll go this way. Oh boy. This is excellent. Alright, here is the blood spatter area. That's good. That's good. If we go... Let's see. If we go down this We're corridor... Here. Yes, this is it! That's the door I was telling you about. I'll pretend I believe you for now. No matter how crazy this sounds. Alright, let's GTFO, girls! So... What kind of door handle did you have in mind? Isn't it obvious? One, that's suited for a door like this. Uh... Alright, yeah, just be as cryptic as possible while someone's trying to kill us. So... What kind of door handle did you have in mind? Isn't... Oh, one. we're just... Same thing. Alright. Um... Well, all we have is a doll, so... Oh, Jesus. Really? I've got to discover how to open the... I mean, there's no way to draw on it or anything? I figured if I drew on it, it would work. Alright, let's... This is apparently the corridor. Alright. Maybe... If we... Get to the area where the pumpkins had blown up... that we can use the red goo now this is the 666 area what's with the pumpkins dinner <laughs> sorry that was me vomiting not so much in my mouth just all over my keyboard if you notice there's flies everywhere this is disgusting Oh, we can't even gra grab the red goo out of the pumpkin? Can we grab the doll and use it? I gotta tell you, I am so glad that I try everything. I really am. Who would have thought that we're gonna use the freaking doll like a paintbrush? Whatever. Let's go, girls. I'm starting to get the hang of how this freaking corridor system works. Uh, this, this way? Crap. Oh, boy. Uh, no, that's the meaty room. Random meaty room. Shoot. Alright, I was getting the hang of how this works. Okay, I think it's this way. Nope, that's the chair. Ugh. All right. This way. This way. This. This. Son of a bitch. Wait, did we just come from here? 
Where's the door? Oh! What is this? This is the nothing room. No! Oh no, hopelessly lost. All right. How many different ways can there be? Come on, Gray. This, this isn't that hard. Okay, go down here. Does this just pop us back out here? Yes, it does. All right, we can't go this way. All right, so we have to go down this corridor. We go down this corridor. Okay, we can't go that way. So we have to go down this corridor. All right. So once we get down this corridor, just double checking, that does bring us out there, right? Okay, yeah, I am slowly figuring this out. Oh, right. That's not a that's not a room. That's actually a place you can go to. Ah, whatever. Oh, this is it. Let's open this beach up with the bloody doll. And we have a perfect door handle. Now, how do we use it? Push it. I wouldn't call it perfect, but it's good enough to get us the hell out of here. Oh, it's working. Yes! No! What was that in the background? Sorry. I saw that for a second. What the hell was that in the background? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. It's a bunch of mirrors with lips on them. That's not what I was expecting, but still just... I'm going to keep moving. Oh, another door. Welcome to my house, young lady. Who... Who are you? I have so many names. It's hard to pick them. But the only thing that truly matters is who you think I am. Don't take any of her crap, Agnes. A demon, a hallucination, a bad dream. Are you the devil? You must be the bitch that the poor girl was talking about, yeah. An unlucky victim of a lick augmentation gone wrong, I couldn't care less. Let's go with this one. You must be the bitch that poor girl was talking about. <laughs> All right, Agnes. Way to go. You told her what for. Open the door. Oh, it looks like, Come uh... closer. I'm not as scary as they paint me. Yeah, speaking of paintings, apparently Artsy McSucksby has been through here with his terrible hand of drawings as well. We've got... Senor Melty Face over here, and then we've got Marilyn Manson at the top right. And then I don't know what that is, like a fetus or something in, in utero. Please be my guest. Have some soup. Yeah, I'm not I'm not drinking your soup, lady. No thanks. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, no. No thanks. Why? Is there something wrong with my soup? Yes. There really, really is. It's blood. <laughs> it's tomato. Yeah, that's not tomato soup, lady. I'm not sure. No, it's not liar. Actually, I'm not that hungry after all. Yeah, you lying hoe. Don't give me that BS. No, it's not. Liar. Oh, dear girl. Why so rude? Calling me names. When all I'm trying to do is to be a good host to my unexpected guest. 
I'm not eating blood. Thank you very much. Then don't. But I bet your good friend Joe would gobble up every last bit of it. Hey, don't you talk about Joe like that, ho. And while you're at it, why not get a haircut? What's that? Is he a vampire? You know Joe. No, he wouldn't, and you're crazy. Yeah, because I was Joe, and I wouldn't drink blood. No, he wouldn't. And you're crazy. I don't blame you. You don't know Joe as well as I do. Yeah? And how do you know him? He's... Uh, a friend of a friend. He came by not long ago. Did you... give him your soup? He only tasted it. But he's already building up quite an appetite for it. I can tell. I believe we may have a misspelling in appetite over there if you guys caught that. Unless, I don't know, it's spelled differently in the Russian version or whatever kind of accent this lady has. Who are you? I mean, who are you really? I have been warned about you. It was nice chatting about soup, but I think I'll go now. I, you know, I'm torn between who are you really and just wanting to leave. I think I'm going to do the who are you really. Who are you? I mean... Who are you really? Why? I'm just a bitch some girl told you about. You said you have many names. I'm just curious which one is real. I've not used my real name for a long time. I don't need names. I am the queen of maggots. Adored and feared by all. And this is my kingdom of death. That's a terrible name. Alright, I've been warned about you. It was nice chatting about soup, but I think I'll go now. But there was once another name, am I right? Yeah, let's dig deeper. But there was once another name, am I right? Yes, there was. But why would I tell you about it? You don't even belong here. Just passing through. I have no quarrel with you, young lady. I'll eat the soup if you tell me. Fine, keep it, whatever. I'm not eating the damn soup, so you guys can suck it, queen of the underworld. Fine, keep it, whatever. I was just trying to be friendly. It was nice chatting about soup, but I think I'll go now, Satan! It was nice chatting about soup, but I think I'll go now. So early? What about the main course? It's been waiting in the oven for a while now. Oh, crap. I'm on a strict diet, actually, goodbye. Maybe some other time, goodbye. No, just no. No. Just... No. All food looks just awful. Why would anyone even want to touch this stuff? Yeah, let's, uh, what the hell? Was there another option there for a second? Take fork. Have you changed your mind about the soup? No. I just wanted to borrow this fork for a minute. If you're not going to eat, leave the cutlery for the next guest. Please. I just wanted to take this fork and stab you to death one with it. One more thing. Yeah? Would you kindly blow out one of the candles in the next room? What? Why? It's just a little tradition in my house. I ask all my guests to do that. Okay. I'll think about it. Yeah, bye. At least someone has good taste in paintings, or rather, good taste in what are bad paintings. Candles. Examine. So many candles in a room full of wood, not safe. I'm not blowing out your candles. You can deal. Flowers. Withered flowers. They've been dead for a long time. Man. 
man, there's like a ton. What the hell? There's something different about this coffin. Let's open it. It's nailed shut. All right, well, forget about that. Oh, it's not gonna let us leave until we blow out the candles. All right, well, I didn't want to give this lady the satisfaction, but I guess we'll do it. Oh, I knew it! The candle causes death! Achievement unlocked right in the schnoz. <laughs> I think that hit him in the chest. Were the, were the painting's eyes following us before? I didn't even notice! Oh god! Ah, don't look at me! Do not look at me, painting! You go to hell! You... What the... I still can't get out? Oh man, I killed someone for no reason? No! Oh, damn it! I'm taking your fork, bitch. Oh, what is this? A loose floorboard? Interesting. Let's remove it. Ah, can't quite fit it, eh? Well, that's all right. We have just the ticket for that. A nice fork. Oh, a crowbar. There we are. I think we can probably use this to pry open the coffin. Damn it, I didn't want to kill that person. I feel really bad now. That's all right, I'll claim ignorance. Actually, what I'll claim is that we'll be opening this coffin in the next episode. So I hope you guys join me then. Stay foxy, much love.